Ah, you paused it. Uh, uh. Hi guys. Came to drip it, drip, drip. Came to drip it, drip, drip. Came to drip it. Okay, that's not why I'm here. <laughs> that's not why you're here, Veronica. Anyways, what's up? It looks dark, Abby. Yeah, I think it looks better now. How's everyone doing? Today's Saturday, the Sabbath day of the Lord. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling blessed. I'm feeling happy. I'm excited. Um, today, what do I have lined up for today? So I'm currently waiting for my friends at Sweet Sensation. And somebody is looking at me just laughing like, what is this girl doing? I swear it's weird when you're holding the camera and recording. But guess what? I love doing this. So I'm waiting for my friends and we're supposed to be going to do like this charity thing. My friend's actually organizing this charity thing and you know, I'm here, to, I'm going to be supporting the cause. Um, we're going to give out food and stuff like that for Christmas Day. Tomorrow's Christmas, uh, I said, did I say Christmas Day? <gasps> I'm clearly too happy. Um, children's Day, tomorrow's Children's Day. And yeah, that's what we're going to be doing, giving out food and stuff like that to kids. And Jao, you guys, this traffic is just because somebody does not because somebody does not want to allow Nigeria, I'm going back to my country, you guys. Going back. Ooh, you're fine. You're fine. <laughs> Look at his back. Oh my God, you guys. <laughs> I'm a pervert, I swear. I had to put my camera down because the guy caught me recording him, but he's fine. Like, you should even see his face. <laughs> he's even finer in his face. <laughs> Sorry, babe. Excuse my lost. Why I was very, very kind of interested in this place was because of the living conditions. Yeah. This is where they live, like rain, sun. They live in this kind of houses and they are really bad conditions. So what we just want to do, this is not an NGO. It's not an organization. Like it's just like a group of friends coming together and just giving something, you know. You know. So. What we have there are provisions. In every bag is rice and gari, all right, and some indomie there. So we just go to like every family, we just give one, you know, to each. Like if you want to say something, you can. If you want to say, give them like like a message, you can. It depends on you. But we go over the group, all right. And then for the children, since it's Children's Day tomorrow, there's some things for the kids there, just like like some some cheese balls arriving up. That will be voices and not echoes in Jesus' name. We thank you for the time here, for giving our time, for giving our talent and our treasures, and that we have reasons to speak on a better platform to help others in Jesus' name. We are prayed. Hallelujah. Are you guys seeing up? Why you will be saying, I can't afford LV. What are your plans for today? Um, the, the party, turn up. <laughs> That's like the main highlight of today. This one has finished. I Just to sleep, they wake up fresh. Turn up. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, it was nice to see you again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Bye, 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 bye. What's up? I'm so full, you guys. You don't understand. I just had lunch and I haven't eaten like this in such a long time. It's weird. I'm full. <laughs> Anyways, I'm at craft and I'm just chilling. I just wanted to keep you guys updated on my life. I drop you flow, baby. All the ladies, if you feel me, help me sing it out. Oh, yeah. But the pride in you, you just couldn't let me slide by you. Let me slide by. That's why you came back around. 
people. I'm back again in the car. <laughs> Man, my kawaka is quite a lot. So I've just been invited out to um, Mint in Lekki for like there's this guy called Femi Le. I think he's an artist and he plays the guitar and I'm gonna see what's up there. Hopefully it's something that I would enjoy. <laughs> Hi guys, what's up? I'm back from Mint. My day has been quite chilled actually for the first time. This morning I went for the charity event, which I'm sure you've already seen. That charity event, as you can see, the footage was really, really small. Um, and that's because um, what happened? It was so rowdy, you guys. It was so rowdy. After taking time to take Gary and rice and cheese balls and Ribena for the kids, we got there and um, anyway, shout out to you Izu for this initiative Born to Give. It was absolutely fantastic. I had so much fun. I learned a lot from this experience. We actually went to Morocco. On getting there, these people were just all over the place. We were trying to make it as orderly as possible, telling them to queue up, telling them to do this and that, but they weren't having it. One thing led to another, they started snatching the bags from us. Another thing happened, whatever happened again, we started running, like we all had to get in the bus and like start driving. It was just a mess, but um, I learned so much from that experience. Shout out to you, Izo for starting that initiative was absolutely fantastic. One of the things I learned from the charity event was that, you know, a lot of times I get sad when I'm broke. A lot of times when I'm, when I'm broke, you know, I get sad and I'm just like, oh, God has forsaken me, I'm suffering and everything like that. And I think today I was reminded that, um, you know, my life is good. My life is very good, so you know compared to like when I got there I couldn't believe that people were actually living there I mean I've been to pretty bad situations but you know it's raining it was it, was, it looked terrible and I just thank God let's just thank God for our lives and you know when you have the opportunity to help someone please help someone you know don't be one of those people that would say oh you know it's none of my business I don't want to get involved you know that's not what as a Christian that's not what um, Jesus expects us to do and what else did I do today? Oh, I had lunch with a very special somebody. Yeah. And it was really fun. I went to Craft. Craft Gourmet. I'm sure you've already seen that footage as well. <laughs> I love that space. As in that space is so beautiful. If you haven't been to Craft Gourmet, it's inside Mega Plaza. 
It's very nice for brunch and breakfast. Where have I been living? I've never heard of that guy before, Femile. Have you guys heard of him? Because I've never heard of him, but he was so good. But he has this like Adepunle gold, simi vibe. But he also has like, he's also like raw and fresh and like, he's also like very Afrocentric. Like, it was really good, really good, really good, really good. Like, I need to take my hair out, but I don't know what hairstyle to do because I'm just stuck. I feel like if I take this hair out, I'm just gonna get a weave. But it's not practical because I'm gonna be going to the gym. In my last video, I was talking about shawarma, and someone was asking me in the comment section where I get my shawarma from. <laughs> I get my shawarma from Ebano. If you know me, you know that I don't play with that shawarma. I get the mixed one. That's the exact one I get mixed. Even the guy knows. Like when I go there, the guy is just like he already knows what my order is. So yeah, mixed. I get mixed every time. It's so delicious because that mix has like chicken and beef in there it's like suya and they like chicken it's just mixed and it's a fantastic fusion i hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog and yeah i'll talk to you guys later hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm back to you with another video i hate intros you guys i hate intros so much hey guys do you think you'll be married in five years <laughs> i sure hope i'll be if you had to delete one year of your life completely which would it be wow that's a deep question can i just say a massive thank you to all of you guys you guys are absolutely fantastic my birthday was on saturday and you guys just showed me so much love i appreciate that i appreciate you guys ah you paused it uh, uh.